any city, in any country, go to any mental institution or halfway house you can get yourself to. When you reach the front desk, ask to visit someone who calls herself the holder of the frost. If this worker shivers unnaturally, you will be led to a hallway that shouldn't exist where it does. The worker will wave you down the hall and, once your back is turned, will shake his head and mutter, The poor fool. The hallway will get colder as you proceed, but do not make any attempt to warm yourself. If you do, heaven help what will become of you. If you do, heaven help what will become of you. If, at any time, the cold ceases and the hallway becomes warm, you must cease walking quickly and shout, Stop! This is not the answer. If the warmth persists, run. Run as fast as you can for the exit. If you do not make it, then the fires of hell shall consume you. If you do make it, do not stop running. Flee the asylum, the city, the country, for the hellhounds have your scent, and they do not rest. If the cold returns, proceed down the hallway until you come to a door made of solid ice and knock three times. If a soft, womanly voice beckons you to enter, open the door. If a gruff, male voice tells you to leave, pray for a quick demise. Inside of the door, you will find a room made of ice, with frozen stalagmites and stalactites, giving it the appearance of a massive maw. In the center of the room will be a veiled, ivory-skinned woman. Do not look at the woman directly, and say only one thing. What caused their hibernation? She will tell you her story. A story of destruction and devastation, war and famine, life and death, and that of a deep slumber. The story will chill you to the base of your existence, but do not ever look directly at the woman. If you do, your soul will be frozen for all eternity. When she is done, she will remove her veil, but you must not gaze upon her. Her beauty would shatter your mind. If you keep your eyes away from her, she will cup her hands over yours and whisper into your ear. The ice age is over. What will you do? The world will explode in white. And when it subsides, you will be outside of the institution. In your hands will be a large crystal snowflake. That snowflake is optic 29 of 538. The ice age is over. They are starting to fall.